about today? Tell us your story. Well, I'm here today because um, I've lost 75 kgs. Wow. And I would love to know what type of clothes to wear, what shape my body is, what colouring I have to wear. Because I would love to be an inspiration for other women out there. But obviously I also have to look good. So I just want to look um, stunning and I know I'm going to be in good hands and that's what I want to accomplish. So today we're going to be doing a colour analysis and a makeup lesson. A figure analysis where we're going to measure you and see what body shape you have and then we're going to teach you the correct styles to wear to balance your body. We're going to teach you how to accessorize properly, what your clothing personality is, because it's vital we just enhance who you are and don't just take what we like and put onto you. You're never going to feel comfortable with that. Um, Annaline, we work with four different seasons, winter, summer, autumn and spring. It's got nothing to do with the seasons of the year, it's simply the different color combinations that have been put together. And the summer and winter um, are the people with the cool undertones and the spring and autumn are the people with the warm undertones. So we need to find out whether you've got cool undertones to your skin or warm undertones. So after today we're going to be taking all the guesswork out of things. You're going to know exactly what's going to suit you from your hair, your makeup, your accessories, your clothing. Um, so shall we start with the figure analysis? Annaline, I'm sure you've heard of apples and pears before when it comes to figure types, but we've just found that there's more. There's four different figure types. There is the A, the X, the V, and the H. The A shape is typically the pear, so smaller on the top half, getting bigger on the bottom half. The H is when the shoulders and hips are the same width, but quite a boxy waist. Then the V shape is when the shoulders are quite a lot broader than the hips. And then the X shape is the typical hourglass figure, the Kim Kardashians of the world. We don't often find that figure type. It's what all the men want, but we don't often find it. <laughs> and then the perfect figure type is when your shoulders are one inch broader than your hips. Now, you do not have to be a size 32 to have the perfect figure. You can be a size 44 and have the perfect figure when your shoulders are one inch wider than your hips. So it's proportions that we're looking at. It's not necessarily sizing. So we are going to show you how to create the illusion of the perfect figure, even if you don't have the perfect proportion. Your clothing personality is a dramatic romantic. Now you've got to be very careful because you can go over the top very easily. So we're going to have to just calm you down a little bit today. And because um, those are two very um, over the top personalities. So yeah, we, we're going to just take, you've got a lot of bling happening today. For example, I mean, look at all these bracelets and watches and necklace and earrings and sunglasses. <laughs> a little bit over the top. You've really overdone this today, okay? Oh. So we're going to calm you down Mom, quite Mom enough. Mom tells it like it is, so please no. don't be offended. <laughs> but really, it's, uh, you, you're way over the top today, all right? So we're going to um, do quite a few adjustments. Perfect, can't wait. We're at Annaline's house now. We're about to do her wardrobe analysis. We're very brutal. Everything that's the wrong color, style, clothing, personality has to go. And I don't think she's going to be left with much, much, much oh, <laughs> when no. we're finished. <laughs> cool, are you ready? Yes, come through. actually finding a lot of wrong things. I don't pink. think she's going to be left with much. Her pink favorite, jelly, color, her favorite pink. color and it's the worst color for her. It just enhances Shame. the pink in her skin. It's her whole cupboard. And, um, pink and black. And you know why people wear black is because it's a slimming color and it's a safe color and on the wrong skin tone it can actually be re-aging. So we're getting rid of all the pink, all the black and leaving her with not much. <laughs> what is this? A boob tube. A boob tube? Yes. How big were your boobs? Very big. But I thought I was very sexy. Uh, <laughs> that is crazy. Oh, Wow, we've just finished Annaline's wardrobe analysis and unfortunately she's got very little left. She was shockingly wrong with her colours and her styles were okay, but yeah. Shame, I think after losing so much weight she would have gravitated towards styles that made her feel good about herself and not necessarily the right colours. So Mom and I went in quite brutally, removed all the pink, all the black, and she doesn't have much left because those were her two favourite colours. So off to the shops now to buy a new wardrobe.
Here we are at the hair salon on Makeover Day. I think Annalena's feeling a little bit nervous about what color we're going to take her hair. We've discussed a couple of options and I think we've decided to go with a dark blonde with a few golden blonde coils pulled through. Mom seems to think she should go darker. I, again, usually seem to think she should go lighter. But um, hopefully we get to a great finished product at the end of the day. Yeah, I just feel that that very bleached blonde hair is just really overpowering on Annalene. It's creating a pinkness on her skin, making her look a little bit pale. And I really think we need to take her to a slightly warmer, light auburn brown or gold, dark golden blonde with a few golden blonde foils pulled through just to cut the pink out of her skin. And the darker hair will also enhance her eye color. So here we are with our fabulous hairdresser Grant. Thank you. He is amazing. Probably the best in the country and we only work with the best. Grant, can you tell us yes. what the plan is for Annalene's hair? Well, we've got big plans for Annalene's hair today. Mm -hmm. and, big uh, is the big, key word because uh, she has got big word. hair. <laughs> you know, we're, we're going a couple of shades darker. Mm -hmm. And, um, and I think she's quite nervous about it. I eh? think she's quite nervous about it, but, but you know, we've reassured her that it's, we, we know that it's always beautiful. Yeah. You know, nobody ever leaves here not looking beautiful without the wow factor. Exactly. So we have a little bit of a process today, repigmentating the hair, which basically means putting back the undercoat mm. so that we can achieve a really lovely medium to dark, warm mm. brunette blonde. So and I know then, with very bleached hair that sometimes it doesn't hold the colour right. Is that why you pre pigmenting? That's correct. Okay. And fortunately for, for us and for Annaline, she's been looking after her hair at home mm. and uh, makes a, a huge difference to the end result when you're working with hair that is Healthy. of good porosity. Yeah. yeah. So because Annaline has warm undertones to her skin, with her makeup we need to do everything to counteract the pink that it throws out. We need to actually use yellowy tones, bronzy tones, corals, oranges to counteract that pink. And that's contrary to what a lot of people think. Sometimes we have pink in our, our skin, so we go and buy a pink foundation, pink blush, pink lips, and it never ends up working. In Annalene's case, we've used a beautiful coral blusher. We've used lovely natural browns on her eyes, and we're going to be using a beautiful coral orangey tone on her lips, which I know sometimes scares people, but it's going to be perfect for her skin tones. I'm also a little bit nervous about how the finished product is going to turn out, but Mom and I are a good combination and hopefully this is a great makeover. You're going to be surprised. I feel gorgeous, I absolutely love the end result and it's just amazing what your girls has done to me. It's just, I look gorgeous. <laughs> well, I'm so it's finally done. It was a bit of a hair raising day. Yeah. What do you think? No, I'm really happy with the outcome and I think she looks stunning. I was a little bit concerned, I must say, in the oh, hairdresser too. when, um, because of the very highlighted hair and some of, some of her re, so she had virgin hair and highlighted hair. And, um, yeah, we were a little bit concerned there, but the minute the hair dried, it all turned out well and um, I'm totally, totally happy with the outcome. Mm. And I think she was a little bit frightened in the hairdresser as well, yeah. and uh, which made me a bit more concerned. However, it turned out so well and I'm really, really happy. Yeah, shame. There were a few moments during the day where we thought this might go a bit bear shaped, but we were in good hands with Grant and he knows what he's doing and the only reason the hair went a few shades of purple and orange at certain times during the day was simply just to pre-pigment the hair and make sure that we got the right color at the end of the day. Yeah. So all in all I think it worked out well and I'm very glad that your husband liked it as well because we know that most men like blondes <laughs> and um, I think he was quite set on having his mm. wife blonde and I think he, he's overjoyed at the end result. Hello. Hello gorgeous. Hi, you. Hello. Love you. Mm. Oh. Um. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. I was a bit nervous. <laughs> it looks stunning. You like it? Uh oh. Yeah. Brings out your eyes. It does. Yeah. Hey. yeah. 
Well, it's just uh, been amazing to be in the kingdom of God and just watching what God's done in our lives and uh, just transforming us. I mean, when he talks about abundant life, he really does. And to watch Ananine just blossom and become the person that God created, it's just been amazing. Yeah. Um, and I could never have done it without him, really. And he also lost weight. And he always says, it's a byproduct of my diet. He wasn't even on a diet. So he was stuck with me. <laughs> and it's worth the journey. It's just fantastic. And each and every day, it's just getting better and better and better. So, yeah, can't wait for the next 50 years. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> So Lebs and Image Insured are running a makeover competition valued at 50,000 rands worth in prizes. All you need to do is watch the space for more information or visit our Facebook page which is facebook.com forward slash Image Insured. <laughs>